Hi folks, Rich Bassini from RJBassini.com. Doing this video today for the first act discovery guitar. If this is the first time coming to my YouTube channel, or in this case, the eBay auction, I do demo videos, sneak peek videos, and intro videos. And this is gonna be a demo video, basically talking a little about the item I'm holding in my hand right now. This guitar, um, is solid wood for what I understand. It's got a wood base, you know, wood uh, frame here, whatever. And it's solid, okay? It does come with a built-in amp, okay? It requires a nine volt battery. That's in here that is not included with the purchase, by the way. And I guess this is where you would plug in your external amp. And it has a little thing over here, folks, that have that has phones on, I guess you could pop in headphones, okay? The body itself is clean, as you can see. It's dark blue metallic, you can see the metallics in the video, okay? Overall, the item is very clean, almost like a new condition, I would consider it, in my personal opinion. Don't mind the little smudges from my hands on the bottom here, but you can see it's a real nice guitar, okay? And the only thing with this, folks, if you are the lucky buyer of this guitar, um, there's no strap. I tried to obtain a strap for it. I couldn't do that. I had no luck finding a strap for it, so I'm sorry about that part. But otherwise, um, I think you'd be very happy. Here's the back of it. Well, first, let's look at the neck of it here. Okay. Okay. I'll do the back of it. Is the sides you can see the sides are very clean okay that's the back of it pretty well made too i have to honestly say um i don't know if it's a kid's guitar i would think it is but it's a very well made guitar look at the metal in here the uh the gears look at that folks Look at that, look at the way it's made. Made very well, I'll be honest with you. I think so, anyway, in my opinion. Could be wrong, you know, but I think it's made very well. Okay, and we'll just, we got here. Here is the, uh, that's what it is. Sorry, folks. It's the first act discovery guitar. Okay. I didn't touch any of the uh, tuning keys. I don't want to mess around with it. I'm afraid I'm gonna, <laughs> no, in my luck, I might do something wrong with it. Um. I'm going, to turn, I'm going to power it on. It's six strings, as you can see. Um, it has a built-in amp in it. And I'm going to uh, power off the background music so you can hear it. Um, before I get started with that, I just want to tell you, uh, I put the ad, I put, I put in the description as well. The power switch that goes on and off is a little intermittent. Um, it goes on. It works. I mean, it'll turn it on. But sometimes powering it off, it's a little problem. Now, I don't know if it's because the guitar has been sitting... Uh, sometimes the things sit, you know, maybe the thing ain't working properly. I don't know, but it does work and I'm gonna I'm gonna show that to you I'm gonna power it up power it on um, But with the with the switch, it's very sensitive. I don't know if there's anything loose in there or not I don't know. I don't again. I am NOT going to touch it um, It looks like you probably have an access panel to get here to get to the screws to check out the wiring I am NOT gonna mess with it though. Okay, I know I know you know I don't want to play around with it because it works and you know, like that old saying, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. People may say, well, there might be something wrong with it, so you should, I'm not, I'm not messing with it, okay? Um, I'm just doing this demo video to show you that it does power on, it does play nice. Uh, I'm not a guitar player, so I, I'm not gonna play it. I'm just gonna strum the strings on it, just to let you hear it, uh, with it on and with it off. And uh, you be the judge for yourself, folks, whether you, as to whether you wanna buy this guitar or not. Um, I think if you do, I think you'd be very happy with it. And uh, that's basically it, but just keep that in mind, folks. Um, the switch, remember what I'm telling you, folks? The switch is intermitting. Um, it goes on, it goes off. I mean, you see it's powered off right now, but when I try to shut it off, I have to hit it a couple times before it shuts off. And my reason for stressing that is because if you pop a fresh 9-volt battery, is what it takes in the back over here, this is where the 9-volt battery goes, okay? If you pop a, a brand-new 9-volt battery, and, you know, batteries are expensive, 
You know, that's why I don't include them uh, in a lot of the sales I have. I don't include batteries because they are pricey. And I need the batteries to test out the items I pick up, such as this. Uh, but the reason why I'm stressing is because if you think you shut it off, you know, don't just hit the button and put it on the side. Make sure that light goes off or else you're going to be burning out batteries, okay? So that's what we got. I'm going to, now I'm going to, uh, you know, cut out the background music. And I'm going to let you hear what it sounds like. I'm going to power it on. And uh, we'll take it from there. Let me just power this up very quick here. Okay, now it's quiet. Okay, so what you do is we're just going to power on this button here. Okay, as you can see, it's on. Well, first I wanted to, I should have showed it to you with it off. All right, well, that's, see what I'm saying? All right, now it works fine. Okay, but I'm going to strum it and show you without the amp built in amplifier. I'm going to need a mic here. Okay. I'm just strumming on I'm my guitar player, folks, so I can't, I don't have nothing to play for you. I'm sorry. I wish you could, uh, I could play music for you, but I can't. So I'm just going to strum it. That's how it sounds. Okay. Now with the mic on, I mean with the built-in amp on. Okay. Here you go. All right. You could, the volume works. Everything works. But here's how it sounds. guitar player so I couldn't I couldn't I couldn't it is nice it is a nice guitar. it's well made um if this is a kid's guitar it is really well made I mean considering uh back in the day I grew up with plastic guitars I mean there was so chinsky this is from what I understand this is solid wood you know you could hear that noise just like the amp like uh you you know, when you have like a regular amplifier, you always had that noise in the background. But the built-in amp is, is great. It works fine. Uh, this is the first time I even came across uh, a guitar with the built-in amp. I, I never even knew they had them, to be honest with you. I came across this here. I seen this store. I said, you know something? It looks interesting. It's pl you know pretty clean condition. I said, you know what? Let me check it out. Let me bring it home, make sure it works. I didn't have an 9-volt battery tested, so... Um, Pretty much, I was flying on the, you know, flying on the shoestring here, hoping that it was going to work, and it did. You know, I popped the battery in there, and it worked because, you know, when you're in the stores, you're you're buying these things. You don't know if they're going to work or not. I mean, you know, you can say, well, I could sell it for parts, but I'm not going to sell this for parts because it works. But um, that's the way it sounds. Okay, and it does. The volume does work. Okay. Uh, again, you could put the headphones in here if you want to, you know. And if you turn it all the way down. That's the way it sounds when the switch is off. You know, that's with the volume all the way turned down. Okay, this is what it is, yeah. You might have to tune it up, folks. I don't know. Again, I don't know anything about the guitar as far as that part goes. Um, you can see it's well made. Look at the metal on here. Look at that. Look at the way the metal's made. It's, it's a well, I tell you the truth. For a kid's guitar, if it is a kid's guitar, it is made really well. I mean, I'm very impressed with it myself, to be honest with you. It's made well. It's solid, you know. It's got that solid feel to it. Um, th this here is wood. You know, this is, I believe, is to be wood here. Um, look at the metal over here. Look at the metal on the, uh, the f you know, over here. The tuning keys, whatever. Look at that. All metal. I mean, I know they can't be plastic. I mean, I don't want to just keep harping on it, but I know they can't be plastic, but you'll end up snapping the, <laughs> break, breaking the gears. But look at the way it's made, though. I mean, you know, if this is supposed to be a kid's guitar, it's made really well. Um, <clears throat> but that's basically it. But remember one thing, folks. Remember the switch. Now, let's see if it works now. See, it, see how it's intermitting? It will stay on. All right, now, in this case, it went off. Maybe because it's been sitting, I don't know. Well, maybe not. Now it looks like it went back on again. Sometimes it'll do that, folks. You see, like it's strobing. So like it's strobing. I don't know. It could be a bit. Now, the battery might not be 100% charged in there, you know, like fairly new. Um, it is It is a new ba uh, a used battery, but it still had juice in there. But um, the switch, like I said, it's intermitting. You know, you got to you gotta play around with it. It's probably something minor. So like when you hold it, the light goes off. But when you let go, it comes on again. But it does eventually go off. I know you got to select that there. You got to play around with it. Either move it up or down. It's an intermitting switch. But other than that, the guitar works great, folks. So anyway, if you have any questions about this guitar, uh, please email me at rjpassini at verizon.net, and I'll try to answer any questions that you have about it. Uh, I hope this video helps, and uh, thanks again for stopping by and checking out my auction and the video presentation. I appreciate it. Have a great day. Thank you. Bye.